The following is a presentation of Retro Sports Network, home of the champions of the past, present, and or future, and is inadvertently brought to you by HockeyTournaments.com. If you are looking to find a hockey tournament for you and your team this fall or winter, go to HockeyTournaments.com now. Or if you're still looking to organize a tournament, HockeyTournaments.com places your tournament with the best teams in North America. And that's what I get for throwing this together at 11.58 a.m. How are you? My name is Ron Juckett. This is a new project that we will do over the course of the winter. And it gets a couple, at least one Thursday slot until we get to football season just to try it out. This is the 2004-2005 UVM men's basketball season. The University of Vermont, the Catamounts, they are looking for their third straight America East title. This is a team that knocked off Syracuse in the first round of the NCAA basketball tournament down in Austin, which makes this the most productive UVM team of all time. The coach is a character by himself. It's not me. It's Tom Brennan. And over the course of the next few months, we'll get to know the players. But they open up the season at the Allen Fieldhouse on the campus of Kansas, the University of Kansas, the James Naismith Court. And Kansas has seven future NBA players on its roster, including Wayne Simeon, who is the big, big dude that will get to guard Taylor Coppenrath. Uh, Kansas started 14-0 and finished 23-7 and and lost in the round of 32, the second round of the NCAA tournament, actually in Syracuse, go figure. So I will coach UVM, we'll have some stories along the way, maybe not today. Kansas won this game in real life, but it wasn't a blowout, 68-61. So are you ready? It's time for some college basketball right here on Retro Sports Network. And we even tried to have the court So Simeon and Coppenrath will tip it. T.J. Sorrentine, the pride of Pawtucket, is the point guard for Vermont. David Hain is the small guard. Jermaine Mopagila is the small forward. Martin Climes is the power forward or the designated collector of foul. And the professor, Taylor Coppenrath, from Barnett, Vermont, is your center for Vermont. For Kansas, it's Miles and Langford at the backcourt. Gideon and Moody are the front court, and Wayne Simeon, the leading scorer, number 21 in the country, will tip it against Coffinrath. So, hello, Tribe fan. It's just you and me right now, buddy. So, let's tip this. Vermont will be wearing their green and yellow uniforms, and they will work it from right to left. Get all the names right, right? For Kansas, Aaron Miles, Keith Langford, J.R. Gideons, Christian Moody, and Wayne Simeon with Bill Self in his second year for um, a head coach for Kansas. And so T.J. Sorrentine wins the tip and they'll walk it up. And the first thing he'll do is try to find Taylor Coppenrath inside a pick and roll. The layup is up. The layup is good. And UVM leads early. Now here's Kansas. Simeon the other way. No. Ball is loose. Sorrentine gets the rebound. And Vermont will go on transition three on four. To Hain for three. You betcha. And it's five. Nothing Vermont early. Now Langford, the shooting guard. No. Simeon with the rebound in the paint. Tries to shoot it over. No. Mopajila with the rebound and Vermont will walk it up. So a good first two possessions for the Cats. They lead 5-0 over Kansas. As Sorrentine will walk it up the floor. And let's see what Brennan and company will set it up. They're Simeon, not a good defender of Coppenrath. And Sorrentine will try to do a pick and or roll with him. That's the play. And Simeon commits the foul. And 18.33 to go in the first half. 20 seconds on the shot clock. Kansas in white and blue. Mopajila to inbound across from me. 19 on the clock. 
no one really likes their options. UVM will pass it around. Now Coppenrath, one on one against Simeon, eight on the shot clock. Taylor's going to shoot over and post up the one hander. It's good. And Mopajila gets the rebound. And Gideon, or Giddens gets called for an illegal screen in Kansas. Commits the foul and the turnover. So 17.54 to go in the first half. 7 0 UVM. Early, early on. So the ball is inbounded. And they'll pass it around. Going to work, work clock early. Sorrentine stands at the top of the key for three. He's going to drive on Aaron Miles. <laughs> Simeon cuts him off as well. Runner blocked and rebounded by Simeon. Kansas has numbers. Four on three. Moody loses it out of bounds. And it's Vermont basketball. So Sorrentine tried to drive. Giddens, the small forward, got the block. And Kansas couldn't convert. 17 and a half to go. First half. 7 nothing UVM. This would be an upset. They're going to try to find Mopajila. Foul line extended left. But TJ Sorrentine is hurt. He's leaving the game. And Alex Jensen, the 6'2", 175-pound senior, will come in. So Vermont loses a lot of his offense. But Sorrentine will be back. Mopajila inbounds it. And they'll pass it around. Now Coppenrath, they're going to try to do a pick and roll with him. Moody now guarding him, the power forward. That's the plan anyway. Nine-footer, yes! Six for Taylor. And it's 9 nothing UVM. Now Miles, the Simeon, stolen by Mopajila. And they'll walk it up. Given to Jensen, who walks it across the timeline. 16-43, first half. Hain, foul line extended right. Drives up. Tap back by Climbs, and Mopajila gets the rebound. And UVM will pass it out. Press set. 9 nothing UVM in the early going. They'll run some clock. Now Climbs, who can't shoot for potato chips, as my wife would say. Garnered by Simeon. He's going to try the shot. And Keith Langford is hurt. So Kansas has to go to the bench for the first time, and that will be Lee. Michael Lee, the 6'3", 215-pound senior, averaging five points a game off the bench. Opener for Kansas, opener for UVM. Kansas comes into the game 1-0 and or with the number one ranking in the polls. And UVM, of course, the two-time America East champions. Funny, DC, you mentioned North Carolina. UVM will make a trip in their non-conference schedule to the Dean Dome to play North Carolina. So Mopajila will inbound it for UVM. And again, they're going to try to feed Coppenrath. And Moody fouls him, and so we get our first shots of the game. 16.08 to go. Nope, it's not a shooting foul. Third team foul on Kansas. So Giddens, Moody, and Simeon all have one. Taylor can take a beating. Mopajila will inbound it. 19 on the clock. UVM in no hurry. Now Jensen, with five on the clock, stands at the foul line. Going to drive in against Miles, and Gidden steals it. Kansas has numbers. Four on one, Moody down the lane, and they're finally on the board. 9-2, 15-44, first half. And Vermont will pass it around again. Now Coppenrath, just on the baseline, extended right, guarded by Moody. Coppenrath will make his move. Goes glass, no, but Moody commits his second foul, and Coppenrath will have two shots. So first time from the free throw line for anybody today. Vermont has not committed a foul. Coppenrath makes the first. That's seven for him. <coughs> Taylor Coppenrath, as Galindo comes in for Moody, was the second leading scorer in the country. Not bad for an America East player. Dribbles the ball, gets up the second. It's good. Sorrentine says he can come back. And well, at the next whistle, 11-2, Vermont. 
<clears throat> and there's a timeout on the floor. Charge to Kansas. 15-21, first half. A strong start for UVM. They lead 11-2. So let me give you the first names. T.J. Sorrentine, he's the one that made the walk-off three against Syracuse. David Hain, averaging 30 points a minute. Good defender. Jermaine Mopagila was an exchange student and was a good defender, not a great offensive. Martin Klein seems to be our designated foul getter. He's an average defender, really doesn't play a lot of offense. And Taylor Coppenrath is just is a center center. Not a great rebounder, but a center center. And should play about 37 minutes a game. Oh, for sure. It really did help him. It took a while for Vermont to realize that. But when they did, they actually started scheduling some massive and murderous preseason or out of conference games. So Giddens and Bounds in front of me, and let's see what Kansas done. Simeon in the lane, and it's fouled by Hain. First foul on UVM this afternoon. Friday night, November 19th, 2004. There's the date for this. And again, Giddens will inbound it right by me. And Miles, Aaron Miles to Galindo for three, in and out, rebound Miles and climbs. As I said, he collects fouls, and he gets one, his first of the game. So, second foul for UVM. And they're going to inbound it by the basket. Simeon goes up for the dunk. No, blocked by climbs, and Mopajila gets the rebound. And Sorrentine back in the game will walk it up right to left for Vermont. Sorrentine dribbles, going to take his own, call his own three. Stolen by Aaron Miles, and they will lock it up. I'm surprised they don't go a fast break. Simeon in the post over Coppenrath. That's good, 11-4. to four. So since the TV timeout, Kansas is four straight. UVM will pass it around. Coppenrath from the outside, guarded by Miles. We'll try to draw the foul here. He's going to go inside. Drives to the hoop. Off the glass and in. And Galindo commits the foul. And Taylor got what he wanted. So he gets the contact. And he's got 10 points. And goes to the line for potential number 11. Did he? Who was he, DC? Brennan's an absolute legend up here. And, of course, Tom, after he retired, I think it was after this year, did a number of um, studio stuff for ESPN. Not too far away from here in Bristol, Connecticut, about two and a half hours. Coppenrath hits the free throw, and it's 14-4 to UVM. He has 11 points. Almost halfway home in their first half. Galindo for three. Climbs got a piece of it, and Sorrentine got the rebound. And Vermont will walk it up. Payne deep in the corner. And now they'll set up the play. Sorrentine guarded by Miles from the foul line. Stolen by Lee. Miles for Kansas. To outside drives up off the rim. Simeon gets the rebound. That's his third. And he brings home the dunk. So Wayne Simeon has four points and three boards. 14-6 UVM. Vermont will pass it around. Climbs. Guarded by Galindo. Is going to take a shot from just inside the paint. Simeon gets a block. Miles gets the rebound. Kansas will lock it up. Now Gideon's. Foul line extended. Jumper good. And it's 14-8. Vermont playing good offense. But Kansas, you knew they weren't going to be down forever. They pass it around. Coppenrath again will try to draw drive on Simeon and he's blocked by Simeon. Finds with a rebound and Sorrentine will set it up. 
was not on the rim. 16 on the shot clock. Mopajila. From the left side. Kansas in the zone. Jumper, no. And it's out of bounds. Kansas ball. 11.57. First half. 14-8 UVM. Anthony Anderson. I don't remember him. Vermont's always had good luck recruiting from the Golden Horseshoe of Ontario. Especially for the women's game. Kansas Miles. Giddens on the baseline to Simeon. No, Coppenrath gets the rebound. That's his first, and Vermont will lock it up. If they're going to give Coppenrath shots, Sorrentine's going to play pick and roll. Coppenrath is knocked to the floor, and Galindo is called for a second foul. 11-24, so Giles comes in for Galindo. And Vermont will go to the bench. Kyle Saplicki from... Shelburne, Vermont, comes in at the shooting guard. Ryan Schneider in for Mopajila as the small forward. And Josh Duell, who gets some great minutes off the bench. And it's a power forward. So Duell will inbound for Vermont. And again, feed Coppenrath. Little runner, no. Sorrentine with the rebound. He passes it out to Jensen because I hit the wrong button. And UVM will set it up. Duel. The power forward sits baseline extended left. And he wants a three. Simeon and Jensen are exchanging words. Coffin wrap. The Sorrentine jumper, no. Rebound, Miles. That's his third for Kansas. And they'll walk it up. Lee. Over to Simeon, off the glass and in. 10.50 to go. Lead is four, 14 to 10. And they're going to try Jensen way over on the right. And Jensen gets called for an offensive foul. And Tom Brennan is not a happy camper. Timeout on the floor. 10.37, first half. UVM 14, Kansas 10. It was supposed to be Saplicki. So UVM dresses 12, and that's all they'll dress all year. So Sorrentine, Saplicki, Schneider, and Duell, and Coffinrath for the moment. Kansas ball. Giles to inbound. By me. Giddens for three. No. Simeon gets the rebound and tries to jump her. No, and it's out of play. Vermont ball. And so they'll walk it up and set up the clock. They'll pass it around Coppenrath. Simeon playing to nine inside. Coppenrath is going to go to the well again. And good luck. No, but Giles will file him and foul him, and Taylor will shoot too. UVM is already in the bonus. And Coppenrath has 11 points. First one from Taylor is good. Make it 12. 15-10, UVM. Kansas in the 2-3 zone. Coppenrath hits them both. He's got 13. So one man wrecking crew right now. Miles will walk it up. Simeon for a long three. No, Schneider with the rebound from Vermont. And Sorrentine will walk it across the line. He's going to try his own shot here. From the top of the key. He loses it from 15. No. Giddens has the rebound. Langford's ready to come back for Kansas. Here comes Miles. Giles. Pump fake runner. No. But Steiner commits the foul and goes to the line for two. So 9-24 first half. 16-10 UVM. What an upset this would be. First one from Giles is good. C.J. Giles plays about nine minutes a game. Duel slides to center. Timothy McCrory goes into small forward, and Schneider now is the power forward. 16-12, both free throws are good. So Kansas 0 for 5 from three-point land, Vermont 1 for 1. 
Vermont still in a slowdown. Sorrentine, guarded by Miles, will attempt the drive. He collided with Simeon. No good, but Simeon gets called for a second foul, and TJ goes to the line for two. So Vermont knowing what to do. They're drawing fouls left and right. That's eight on Kansas, and this is a two-shotter. TJ has no points, three rebounds, and one assist. And around and out. So he still can't get on the score sheet yet. <coughs> so Langford enters at for Lee at the shooting guard. And Cowan comes in for Wayne Simeon with the two fouls. Kansas has three players with two fouls already. Second one from Sorrentine is good. 17-12 UVM. Here come the Jayhawks. Langford for three. No, Ryan Schneider gets the rebound, and UVM's going to run. McCrory and Duell back. McCrory, nope. Laid it up. No, Miles with the rebound, and here comes Kansas. Langford to Miles. Drives in the paint, and that's good, and it's a three-point game, 17-14. Sorrentine. Sees Duel open for a three on the outside, but Pawn gets the foul on him, and it's a one on one for Josh. David Hain ready to come back. First one from Duel, no good. Rebound McCrory. Vermont will set it up again. Goes up for the rebound. No, right to Giles the other way. And here comes Kansas. Miles. He's not, he hasn't sat yet. To Giles, off the glass from the baseline, it's good. It's a one-point game, 17-16. Sorrentine, guarded by Miles. From Saplicki, 15-footer, no. Schneider gets the offensive rebound, and Sorrentine will set it up again. This time Vermont will use some clock. Schneider, power forward, not a good shooter. We'll try the outside jumper. Yes! 19-16, Sorrentine with the assist, and Miles trying to run a play and stepped out of bounds. So Vermont Stop it. We'll bring in three starters. Hain with one foul. Mopajila and Kappenrath are ready to go. 7-14 first half. Vermont 6-17 from the floor. Kansas 7-19 from the floor. Now you got to do it yourself. How you doing, I.D.? It does have all the conferences and stuff, but there are way too many wild cards. So, so bracketology, if we get that far, will be done by moi. So, 1916, the lead is three. Coppenrath on a pick and roll. And Coppenrath knocked on to the floor, and that's his first. So, Lee comes back in to give Miles a rest. Nine fouls for Kansas, five for UVM. Kansas one away from putting Vermont in the double bonus for the rest of the half. ID Jester and Clinton Parks, how are you? So here comes Kansas. Giles pick and roll, blocked by Duel. Mopajila comes down with the rebound. And Vermont will set up the play. Hain brings it up this time. And Hain will try his own three from the right side, but he couldn't get the shot off as it's a shot clock violation. Galindo back in with two fouls for Kansas. He's at small forward. Kansas is 0 from 6 from three-point land. Vermont 13 rebounds to 10. But the turnovers are 5-4. Vermont and having more. 6.07 to go, first half. Langford, the lead. Stolen by Mopajila. And UVM will walk it up. Sorrentine into the front court. Sorrentine guarded by Lee. From Hain lays it off the glass. No, Giles blocks it. Galindo gets the rebound. And Kansas will walk it up. 
Langford, jumper from 15, no, Coppenrath gets the rebound, and Vermont is very content to trade rebounds. Hain again this time will bring it up. Coppenrath guarded by Giles, Lower team. Slam it home, 15 for the Professor, and it's 21-16. Now Lee with a quick jumper back the other way makes it 21-18. So again, as long as Vermont scores, Kansas can score all they want. Sorrentine slows it down. Coppenrath, guarded by Giles, who's tired. Coppenrath breaks down the rim, and it's an easy layup for Taylor, who has 17 on the game. Giles the other way from a bounce pass, and it's still 23-20. So Coppenrath has 17 of UVM's 23 points. TJ, guarded by Lee, <coughs> tries to barrel it in, lays it up, no. Duel with, gets the rebound, and Sorrentine has missed six straight. Duel, second chance, around and no. Coppenrath, he'll try to slam it home. No, but Lee commits the foul. That's his first, and Coppenrath will go to the line for two. So 23-20, and Coppenrath has 17 points in 14 minutes. First one from Taylor is in and out. And now Kansas is in the double, or UVM has a double bonus the rest of the half. Giddens back in at small forward, and Jackson is in for the first time today for Kansas. Jensen goes in for Sorrentine and climbs. Gets to play the designated heavy now back in at power forward. Second one from Coffinrath is good. He's got 18, 24, 20. Now Miles, they pass it around. Miles finds Kahn from 15. No, and climbs. Makes the bad foul, and Kahn will shoot too. But he's only a 33% free throw shooter, and the first one is in and out. So Kansas 2 of 3 from the line, UVM 7 of 10. The leaf climbs in for the moment. Second freebie is good, and it's 24 21. UVM will pass it around. Coppenrath, guarded by Kahn in the paint. Little runner blocked by Kahn. Here comes Giddens, and Kansas will run the break. Jackson to Langford for three. No. Jensen will have it on the rebound, and back comes UVM. Now Hain with it, and UVM will set up the play. They're going to keep feeding Coppenrath. Point blank range. That's good. He's got 20. 26 21. Now Giddens for three the other way. No. Rebound Kansas. Langford. Miles with it. Now to Langford. Oh, but Chula fouls him. And Langford will shoot two as Vermont has put Can has a one on one on non shooting fouls, where Kansas does. So, first foul for Mopa Gila. 26 21 UVM. Langford misses the first. 2 12 to go in half. Ah. Uh. You should do lunch for sure. Talk to Dave Gardner. He's got a nice one in his neck of the woods. Go Catamounts. How you doing, Al? Al had a good time playing his 1968 AFL-NFL tournament. I don't know if Al realizes he's having a good time. But that was a good one last night. Langford hits the second, 26-22. Vermont by four. Jensen. What? What was that? Whoops. Nine on the clock. And climbs in the post, stolen by Gibbons. Here comes Kansas. Miles locks it up. Into Jackson in the post against Climbs. Runner. No. Mopajila gets his fifth rebound. And UVM will run some transition. Coppenrath. No. Mopajila gets the rebound. They'll pass it around. But Giddens picks his pocket. And here comes the Jayhawks. Giddens drives and gets called for the charge. 
So Galindo goes in for Giddens, who is exhausted. Sorrentine ready to come back in. One away to go first half. Oh my goodness. Johnny Most, by the way, used to call Brooklyn Dodger games. Did you know that? Vermont. We'll pass it around under a minute. Coppenrath, guarded by Giles. At center. Post one off, blocked by Giles. Coppenrath gets his own re gets it back. Puts it up, stolen by Galindo, and off goes Kansas. Three on two. And it's a bad pass from Miles to Jackson. And Vermont will have it with 36 and change on the clock. Not the father of Donnie Most. His color man was Dick Williams. Was it really? I miss Ralph Melf. So Sorrentine being guarded tightly by Aaron Miles. We'll find Mopajila on the left side. 2-1-2. Two, two. Mopajila drives, lays it up. No, but Galindo will foul him, and that's his third. And Jermaine Mopajila will shoot two. 14 to go in the first half. 26-22 UVM. And what would be an upset of the number one rated Kansas Jayhawks? At home, no less. First one is good. So if your name is not Taylor Coppenrath, Vermont has seven points. <laughs> My goodness. Mopajila's second one is up. No. Rebound, Jackson. And this will be the end of the half, I'm sure. Miles will walk it up. Five to go. Jackson drives and makes the dunk. Nine tenths of a second left on the clock. Sorrentine doesn't want to even keep it up. And it's been a one fantastic half of basketball. 20 minutes in the books. Groovy Yubi, 27. Rock Chalk Jayhawk, 24. Coppin Rath is 7 for 12 from the field and 6 of 7 from the line and has 20 points. And Kansas looks absolutely poopy. Considering that, as I said, they have seven NBA players in this game. Yep, okay. What do you mean, go Jayhawks? It's a pro UVM stream. I would do Johnny most, but I have to talk at some point today again. So six rebounds for Mopajila. He leads the team. Kansas, Simeon, and Miles have four assists. UVM is not a good rebounding team either. I doubt this will last, but for 20 minutes, we can think that Vermont led the number one team in the country. How you doing, Amish Elvis? Glad to have you along. So the possession arrow belongs to the Catamounts as we start the second half. Starting five for both sides, no changes. Miles into Simeon, over to Giddens, and that's out of bounds. So Kansas, who had seven turnovers in the first half, turned it over in the, to start the second. Vermont will pass it around. Coppenrath, they just, he's a magnet. He's actually being doubled right now. Passes it out to Sorrentine for a three. Coppenrath, nope. He goes over the double team and hits. Now Simeon, loose ball, cut off by Coppenrath. No, Sorrentine gets the rebound. And Vermont, 29-24. Sorrentine, into the Vermont part of the gourd. Again, Coppenrath. Well, that was the intended call, and Sorrentine just zipped it away. So, turnover, Vermont's ninth. Kansas ball, they trail by five. I missed what Clinton said, but yeah. Nope. This is the big deal up here. 
And let me tell you, once we get into conference play, UVM is going to have its way with some teams. Miles on the wing for Kansas. Look and roll with Simeon. Off the glass and good. That's eight for Wayne. And it's 29-26. UVM sets it up. Coppenrath has it. Guarded by Simeon. Inside. Eight-footer blocked by and rebounded by Simeon. Great play. Got his own block in the rebound. Now Langford over to Moody. Miles and Mopajila are trading words. And Mopajila gets the steal. That's his third for Vermont. Sorrentine off the leg of Miles. And it's still Vermont ball. 17-31 to go in the game. Yes, they are. All right. Thanks, Al. Yep, the America East, and of course, you know, Maryland, University of Maryland at Baltimore College had to win a game up at U, up here just to get in the tournament because UVM had won the regular season, and America East does it stupid with their conference tournament. They're all home games now. So you go to the higher seed. There's no neutral court, which is absolutely dumb, and Vermont played a terrible game. And I didn't think that UMBC had a snowball's chance in hell. Well, I was wrong. Bobagila inbounds. They're going to try Cop and Ranth again. Over, blocked by Moody. Simeon with the rebound. Vermont needs to find something else. Langford walks it up. Over to Giddens for three, and that's good. And we're tied at 29. Uh, Stony Brook, Albany, Hartford, UNH, Maine. You, no, we're not CAA. America East. Uh, Binghamton is one. Uh, one of the Boston schools is America East, too. They'll pass it around. Again, Coppenrath has it. Guarded by Simeon. Inside is Taylor. And the professor jumper. Yes, he's got 24. And it's 31-29 UVM. Now Langford. Miles. Drives the paint the other way. And we're tied at 31. Sorrentine walks it up. Circus jumper is good for three. Or two. He was just inside there. And he's fouled by Aaron Miles. Who says a couple things to the ref. And Sorrentine goes to the line for one. It's a two-point shot and then a one. And it's 33-31. Sorrentine hits the freebie, and it's a three-point game again. 16-08 to go in the ballgame. Bobby Canelano, it may be BU. Northeastern was there back when it was the Northeast Conference. Simeon. Miles with Simeon, and Coppenrath fouls him on the slam, bam, thank you, ma'am. The alley-oop works, and Simeon now with 10 points can tie this game up at 34. Two for Coppenrath. Free throw around and in, and then we are knotted at 34. Timeout on the floor. 15-49 left in regulation. UVM hanging tough with the best team, preseason team in the country. Kansas Jayhawks, right here on Retro Sports Network. Mopajila will inbound. Kansas playing a 3 2. Sorrentine in the power zone number. Bounces, Coppenrath hits an air ball, climbs with a rebound, and back out to Sorrentine. Sorrentine was told to shoot a 3 and didn't do it. Mopajila. 17-footer. Foul line extended left. Will he shoot it? Yes, sir! And Sorrentine gets the assist. He's got six. 36-34. Giddens for three the other way. That's an NBA three. And Kansas goes up by one. Vermont will pass it around. Mopajila guarded by Giddens. Going to try a jumper. Baseline jumper. No. Giddens gets the rebound. And back comes Kansas. Miles, the point guard, from 18. Click and roll with Simeon, the lob, and Coppenrath fouls Simeon again, and Simeon hit the basket. 
So Kansas now exerting some pressure. 39-36. And UVM will go to a half-court trap. Free throw from Simeon is good. 40-36 Kansas. UVM passes it around. Sorrentine. Guarded by Miles. Top of the key. Drives up. And it's batted around. And Moody gets it. Sorrentine can't hit anything right now. Kansas fast break. Miles for three. And it's 43-36. And so Kansas had a good halftime talk. And Vermont needs to get offense from somebody besides Taylor Coppenrath. They'll pass it again. Coppenrath has it. Guarded by Simeon. And Simeon gets called for a reaching foul as third. Second team foul. And Vermont with 20 on the shot clock will reset. Yes, they are. UVM and Maine ladies have been fierce rivals for a, lo a long time. Albany and UVM are pretty good rivals, too. <laughs> no, Roy Williams isn't here. It's Bill Self's second season. We will see Roy Williams with North Carolina when UVM makes a trip to the Dean Dome. So, Opagila unbounds it for the Cats. 19 on the clock, they'll pass it around. Opagila finds himself with it. Outside jumper guarded by Giddens, and that's good. He's got five. 43-38 Kansas. Miles. Bounce pass to Simeon, and Simeon just rocks it home. So Coppenrath kind of playing skittish, and Simeon trying to exclaim my authority. Climbs. Left side. Baseline will try to go in the low post. Shoots and scores! A rare basket for him. 45-40. Langford for three the other way. Miles gets it. The rebound. And Kansas sets back up. Get in. There's a whistle. And Mopajila is called for the foul. Third on UVM. And two. Kansas has two. 12-13 to go in the ball game. Ryan Schneider and Tim McCrory come in for the Cats. UVM, 8 for 14, that's inside. That's pretty much Coppenrath. They haven't been able to drive on Kansas. Moody to inbound it for the Jayhawks. Miles and Sorrentine holds them like they're at a dance contest. And that's the fourth foul on UVM. 20 on the shot clock. Oh. Yes, the Kansas coach takes a picture of his face. It is it is a Bill selfie. And there's a lot of Bill selfies around. Moody inbounds it right by me for Kansas. Inside, runner is good. UVM will try Schneider on a three from the left corner. No. Coppenrath tips it. No. Simeon gets the rebound. Here come the Jayhawks. They'll take their time setting it up. Simeon to Miles, and Schneider and Moody are tied up. But since we got the jump ball, possession arrow goes to Kansas now because that was Vermont. Hain wants out next whistle. McCrory to inbound. 15 on the shot clock. Again, they're going to try Schneider with the three. Deep in the corner, no, but Moody commits the foul. And Schneider gets three shots with the clock stopped. 11 17 in regulation time. Remember, Kansas won the real game 68 61, so it was an actual contest. Schneider misses the first. Bends the knees, bends the wrists too hard, he'll miss the second. And Kansas, pretty much, with the exception of Giddens, goes to the bench. Robinson and Lee will be the backcourt. Giddens and Galando, or Galindo are the forwards. And Kwan, K-A-U-N, is the center. 
Kyle Saplecki comes into play, shooting guard. Sorrentine and Coppenrath remain in the ballgame. Steiner hits one of three, and it's now 47-41. 11-17 to go. Timeout on the floor. Kansas 47, Vermont 41. This is UVM Basketball on Retro Sports Network. Giddens to a bound for Kansas. Outside, 15, no. Coppenrath gets the rebound. That's his fifth. Over to Sorrentine of Vermont. Hopes to take... Oh, Saplicki will actually bring this up. Going to try to feed Sorrentine a three. Long three, no. Galindo with a rebound for the Jayhawks. Kansas has numbers. Robinson is fouled by Sorrentine, and that's the fifth on Vermont. So, Kansas... Outscoring Vermont 23-14 here in the second half. And that's not a surprise. You knew Kansas wasn't going to play as poorly as Vermont. And right now the trap hasn't done jack squat for UVM. Giddens to inbound it for Kansas. For three and he hits it. So he's got 11 points and it's now a nine point game. 50-41. We're going to try to flip one into Coppenrath inside. Blocked by Kahn. Schneider with the offensive rebound. Schneider in the paint. Tries a second chance. It's good. He's got five. 50-43. Lee wide open. Jumper is an air ball, and it's Vermont ball. <clears throat> so Langford comes in for Kansas. Halfway home here in the second. Jensen and Duell come in for Coppenrath and Sorrentine. Sorrentine's had a good game except for shooting. So I'll bench for Vermont. And they'll pass it around. Schneider, again, wants to take another three. Galindo with the steal. Uh, Kansas has numbers. Galindo drives in the paint. Good. 52-43, Kansas. UBM needs something now. Schneider to Saplicki on the wing, and he hit the shot, but he's fouled before it. <clears throat> Saplicki and Brennan say, come on, we were there. Nope, nope, nope. Big 12 officials want none of that. And so Brennan just waves his hands at him. Ah. Uh. Dave Gardner made it. Dave Gardner loves college basketball. Absolutely loves it. We talk about it all the time. McCrory inbounds it for UVM. Jensen, 19 on the clock, wants to take a three. Long three. Good! 52-46. It's a six-point game. Now Lee, open the other way, hits it. 8.38 to go. Vermont. Tries to set up the right play. Schneider. Over Galindo over the baseline. Flutter is good. Duel gets a great pass, and it's 54-48. Vermont finally learns how to trap. Lee. And Jensen gets called for the reach, and that's six for UVM. And now we get lots of starters coming back in for Kansas. And all but climbs now coming back in for UVM. So 54-48, UVM has acquitted themselves quite well here. Max Cornelius, how you doing? Langford inbounds it. Kansas by six. Simeon runner is good. Wayne Simeon, remember Kansas, is, this is their first game too. Got it into high gear here in the second half. 7.50 to go in the ballgame. Duel. Guarded by Simeon. Wants a three. Sorrentine. You duel deep. And he calls time. So there's only two timeouts left for UVM. Kansas has three. 7.32 to go. Eight point lead for the Jayhawks. Mopajila to a bound on the far sideline. We need to get Sorrentine involved. 
Jermaine Mopagila hit his hand and he'll remain in the game. I don't know if it got stepped on. Oh, you know what? He actually hit a chair when he went. He swung back to inbound the ball and he, you can see it there. He, ow. He's shaking a finger, but he says he's okay. And Vermont will pass it around. Now Sorrentine. Guarded by Miles will take the three and he makes it 56 51. Vermont in the trap. Langford to Lee outside. No, but Payne makes the foul and Lee will shoot two. 56 51. So four points and two assists for Lee and he hits the first. Michael Lee. For the second, and it's good. 58-51, Kansas. Under seven to go. And they're going to try to feed Sorrentine down to Coppenrath. Kansas in a 2-1-2 zone. They pass it around. Coppenrath hits the jumper from Sorrentine. He's got 26 miles to Simeon. Told him by Sorrentine. And Vermont will walk it up. It's a five-point game. UVM passes it around. Mopagila guarded by Langford. Under six to go. Sub 15 footer. You betcha. 58 55. Here comes Vermont. Simeon with a miss in the paint. Mopagila with the rebound. And Vermont will walk it up again. Jermaine Mopagila, seven rebounds for the Cats with seven points. Coppenrath has it. Guarded by Kahn in the paint. Up, yes. Sorrentine with eight assists. Coppenrath with 28 points. It's a one-point game. Lee, baseline drive stolen by Mopajila. And Vermont will lock it up. They can take the lead this time round. Under five to go. Payne to Sorrentine. Deflected out of bounds, and it's Vermont ball. So Simeon goes back to center. Moody comes in. Marty climbs. And will come in. So starting five on the floor for the Cats. They trail by one. Possession arrow in favor of Kansas. If we need it. Mopajila inbounds. TJ. Going to call his own number. 15-footer, no, but Mopajila gets the rebound to keep it alive. And UVM will pass it back out. Fresh 35 on the clock. One-point game, Kansas 58, the UVM 57, Sorrentine. Going to try another long three. Yes! UVM leads by two, 60-58. Simeon drives up. He's got it. Kansas is tied the game. Under four to go. This place is rocking. But please come and knock in. Miles with a slapping foul. And with 29 on the shot clock, Vermont will inbound it. 336. 60 60. Mopajila will inbound. Climbs wants the shot. They'll try it. Guarded by Moody. 2 1 2 zone for Kansas. Climb rises up. No. Rebound. Lee comes down with it. Kansas tries to beat the trap. Moody to Sim from Simeon. Got it back. Stolen by Mopajila. That's his fifth. UVM's got numbers. Sorrentine for three. No. Moody with a rebound. Kansas again tries to beat the trap. Three to go. Moody dribbles back, fires a long shot, no. Rebound, Coppenrath. 251. Vermont pushes it up the floor. Hain. Oh, it's out of bounds, and it's Kansas ball. So Langford and Miles are now in the backcourt. Giddens on full rest, and Moody are the forwards. And Simeon is your center. Simeon is 20, Giddens 11. Those are Kansas's leading scores. For Vermont, Coppenrath 28 and Sorrentine 17 or 10 with eight assists. But Jermaine Mopagila, seven points, eight boards, and three dishes. 
has been the big player the second half for the Cats. Here come the Jayhawks. They're trying to beat the trap. Langford back to Miles and to Simeon, and someone got a foot on it. Need to be reminded it wasn't soccer, and it was determined it was a Vermont sneaker and not a Kansas one. So, again, and no, it's not a Birkenstock sneaker either, just in case someone's thinking about being funny. I believe Vermont's an Adidas school. So, inbounded again by Moody. Needs some help. Does he get it? Yes, Giddens on the side drives into Nopajila, and that's a foul on Giddens. That's his third. So all that and nothing doing for the Jayhawks. 2.19 to go. 60 up. Vermont passes it around. Coppenrath doubled. They're trying to shoot in the double coverage again. Coppenrath. Yes, from Sorrentine. That's 30 for the Professor. Miles passes it around. Simeon lays it up. No, but Coppenrath is called for the goaltend. And with 143 to go, we're knotted at 62. Man, UVM has given them a hell of a game. UVM. Gonna try Hain on the far right corner for a three. Stolen, however, by Moody and Kansas will try to. Nope, they're gonna call a timeout. So they were gonna run the break, and they thought better of it. <laughs> oh my goodness! 62-62. 87 seconds left in regulation. Opening night for both these teams, Kansas. The preseason number one given everything in the kitchen sink by a little old UVM. I didn't expect that to happen. So Bill Self is done talking. Moody will inbound it. Vermont's still in the trap. Miles to Langford. Drives. Met by Coppenrath. No. Bopajila with a rebound. Vermont has numbers. They're running it. Coppenrath off the glass. No! Langford with the rebound, and Kansas will call time. 105 to go at the Allen Fieldhouse. What a ball game. Oh, my goodness. Dave will sub the next time I do a football game. Don't worry about that. So Kansas will inbound. Moody. Simeon in the clutch over Coppenrath. No, but Climes will foul him with 44.6 seconds. Kansas in the bonus. Two shot foul anyway. First one from Simeon. That's good. He's got 23, and it's now 63-62. Simeon. Kansas. I don't think they just took Vermont seriously. Vermont led at the half. Second one up. Good. So Vermont doesn't need to do anything special here. Kansas will play a 2-1-2 zone. 37 seconds to go. They're going to... It's strength against strength. Coppenrath in the clutch. Rises up. No, but Simeon will foul him. That's four on Wayne and Coppenrath with 28.8 seconds. We'll have two free throws. If you can hit them both, we'll be tied. 64-62. Taylor hits the first. 64-63. Vermont, two timeouts. Coppenrath. No! Miles ties it up or gets the rebound. Kansas is milking the clock. Vermont didn't have anything set. Simeon kills the clock. 19 seconds left. Moody will hold it and Haynes finally draws the whistle. Okay, 15 seconds left. And Vermont can tie this. Timeout on the floor. UVM will take it now. 
It'll be a steel foul. One point game. Moody, who has four points and is a 55 and a half percent free throw shooter. One and one. No rebound. Top and rest gets it. Sorrentine walks it up. Six seconds to go. Timeout. Vermont will set it up for the win when we come back. Oh, my goodness gracious. So here we go. Mopajila to inbound it. Seven seconds left. 64. 63 and we've just passed one o'clock here in the east so if you're just joining us this is uvm basketball the 2004-2005 season taking a lunch spot before the 86 nfl season we got the opener against number one kansas and we've had a bag of chips and all that mopajila will inbound and who do you think it's going to be it's going to be Coppenrath. Six seconds left. Sorrentine himself. No, Simeon gets the rebound. Two and a half to go. Well, Vermont foul. They know. Oh, what a ball game. Oh, my goodness. What a ball game. Sorrentine didn't see Coppenrath open, and he did the right thing. He didn't try for a three. He tried for the cutoff, and it didn't work. And so Vermont, you didn't expect him to win anyway, had a chance with six seconds to go to win the ball game. How about that? So the final score, Kansas 64, Vermont 63. And if Vermont can go on the road and only lose by one, remember they lost this game by seven, which was still pretty good. Coppin ran 12 for 23 for 31 points. TJ was hoping to draw a foul. He had 10 for Kansas. Wayne Simming in 24, and Giddens had 11. Wayne Simeon is your MVP. Excuse me, as it should be. He just overpowered them in the second half. You see the final things there. Vermont's bench just as, you know, Kansas' bench could start for Vermont. So Vermont had a 10-point lead, and Kansas had a 9-point lead. And Simeon had 18 points in the second half for Kansas. And Sorrentine had a much better second half. What a ball game. All right. Well, that will do for me today. I hope you enjoyed that. God, that was a lot of fun. Really, really enjoyed it. We're going to do, maybe not live every game, and certainly not in a regular slot. But if you want to see more of this live, let me know, because this was really, really fun. The final score, Kansas 64, Vermont 63. I'm Ron Juckett. We'll talk to you soon, right here on Retro Sports Network, home of the champions of the past, present, and or future.